Hey Starseeds, welcome to Starseed Energetics. My name is Ashtara, mission to bring you some of the highest frequency content. And today I have such a special gift for you in collaboration with Regan Hillier. She loves you guys so much here on Starseed Energetics that she gifted you, specifically for you, a special activation to embody your divine abundance template. And she's going to be sharing some of her wisdom and insight in the transmission beforehand. So as you probably know, the economy is going through a massive shift and the collective consciousness is going through a massive change. But this kind of instability that you may see around you in the economy, it all can be shifted from within. And Regan Hillier is one of the best people to actually activate this because she's a self-made eight-figure businesswoman doing what she loves doing, helping people, helping the collective consciousness, truly in divine service and alignment to her soul. And so I am so honored to bring you this work. All of Regan's social media and websites are linked down below. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel as a mission to bring you some of the highest frequency content throughout these evolutionary cycles and beyond. And without further ado, please enjoy the myth, the legend, the ultra terrestrial sensational starseed, Regan Hillier. Hello, starseeds energetics. What a blessing and a joy to be here with you today. My name is Regan Hillier, and you may have recognized me or my work from the Intuitive Goddess activation on this channel. Thank you so much for all your love and your comments and your gratitude. You're really the, the purpose as to what I do, what I do. So thank you so much. I'm here today to open up a portal of activation and conversation when it comes to truly embodying the abundance template, which is looking to be birthed through all of us right now. And we're going to be going into some specific tips and elements which you can be implementing in your life, but also going into a deep activation, which will allow you to truly embody this next level of abundance and truly be a house for abundance as we step into this new layer and this new reality, which we are all birthing together right now. You know, when I grew up in Auckland, New Zealand, I wasn't born into great layers of abundance. You know, there was actually a lot of struggle, a lot of figuring it out. <laughs> and so, you know, I was blessed to get really deep into my own inner work, my own inner journey around the age of 17, 18. And by the age of uh, 24, I had manifested my first million dollars and it was deeply in my purpose even at that age. And so, there have been many lessons and many layers of evolution and many gifts which I get to share with you and help shortcut this process and actually activate this in your field. It's really important to remember that if we desire to change something material on the outside, right, something in our 3D physical reality, that first must shift through the geometric layer of the energetics. We must actually alter the geometries in those realms, allowing them to then be actually reflected in the physical reality. This is why so many people are doing, doing, doing and working harder and pushing and struggling and hustling, but not really getting to where they desire to be when it comes to abundance. Abundance gets to be easy. It gets to be effortless. It gets to be a natural byproduct of you actually being deeply on your mission, in your purpose and connected to your true service work. And the more that you do that, the more that you say yes and you open and expand your channel to allow all of spirit's abundance to actually come through you. So the activation that we will dive into today is called embodying your divine abundance template. And before we do that, I just wanted to share a little bit around these turbulent times that we're going through right now. We are in a time of great birth. We are in a rebirth process right now. And there are birthing pains. There is uncomfortability. There is a lot of confusion. There is also a lot of suffering going on on the planet. And this process which we're in is actually a necessary and a much needed process in order to open up and create space for the new that's looking to anchor onto the planet right now. The earth herself is upgrading into greater levels of abundance, right? We're seeing planetary shifts taking place and deep shifts within ourselves as well. Every every layer of our being right now is being updated from a 
energetic bodies, our emotional bodies, our physical bodies, all the way down to our DNA is receiving updates right now. So the more that we say yes to this and the more that we allow ourselves to actually go into, into this inner work, then the easier it gets to be and the faster we can actually accelerate this process, okay? So when it comes to looking at what can you be doing in order to truly activate abundance in your life day to day, especially through these turbulent times, the first thing that I want you to do every day is find your center. Find your center because there's so much going on outside that it can be really quite easy to be pulled left and pulled right and pulled into the, the hurricane and the whirlwind of everything which is taking place on the planet right now. But my question to you is, can you be in the eye of the hurricane? Can you be in that total stillness and that total groundedness and that total clarity while the world is going mad around you <laughs> can you keep your center and this needs to be your zero point it needs to be your still point it needs to be your anchor every single day so you can use whatever modality you like to get into that if you get into that centered groundedness through meditation then perfect if you do it through quantum flow embodiment work then perfect if you do it through guided meditations then perfect if you do it through simply moving your body perfect do whatever you need to do to get in that space and that does not have to take hours and hours and hours i'm not suggesting you go and you sit in a cave and you meditate for three hours i'm suggesting that you give yourself five to ten minutes to put the phone away put the computer away put the family away right and close the door and be with you just with you right now the second thing around anchoring all of this abundance that's looking to come through into your reality is to clear out anything that's not abundance clearing out anything which is standing in the way blocking stopping limiting the abundance coming in slowing down the process right if we look at scarcity for example, the old patterns of scarcity that many of us have housed in our field for a long time, scarcity and abundance cannot coexist within you, right? You're either vibrating majority in, in scarcity or the majority in abundance, but you can't be vibrating in both of those states every day at the same time. You're in one or the other. You're in expansion or you're in contraction, right? So the second piece is clearing out anything that's not expansion, clearing out anything that is not abundance, clearing out anything that is blocking you, stopping you. So sit down and ask yourself, what is currently blocking me, stopping me and limiting me and holding me back from truly stepping into this next expression of abundance? And from this place, you, you work with the fear, you feel the emotions, you purge out the scarcity, you no longer tolerate those thought patterns, right? It's going to look different for every person, but that's the second layer right? After you've found this still point, you want to then clear out everything which is holding you back. And then the third piece is to get radically clear on where you're going and what you're creating. Now, I think if you're watching this show right now, you've probably written out your vision before. You've probably done some work around asking, you know, what is it that I actually desire in my life? So I'm suggesting that you push yourself to go a little bit bigger than that. And instead of just saying, what's my personal vision? Really, what's your vision for humanity? What's your vision for this planet right now? What does that look like? And what is your role in that? right? This new humanity is birthing through us. We are in the chaos and the destruction process in order to create space for the new humanity to come through. But guess what? We need leaders. We need people like you to stand up and say, this is my vision and this is my dream. And this is how I see humanity. And here's my role that I'm going to commit to in that. Yes. So dive deep into that as well. Ask yourself that question. And then guess what? You navigate your entire life around that center point, around that pinpoint, around that focus point, around that compass. And you know, your life gets very easy after that. Every opportunity, every person that comes into your life, every shiny object, it's very simple. Does it align with my vision for humanity? If it's a yes, then it's a full body yes. And if it's a no, it's a full body no. <laughs> There's no more, should I do this? Should I do that? Because you're so clear, so crystal clear on where you're going and what you're actually bringing through to the planet. So now we're going to deep dive into this activation.
This is a beautiful closed eye process. It's nice and easy. You get to sit or lie in a comfortable position, simply close your eyes, tuning inwards, and simply just allow yourself to listen to the sound of my voice. If your mind comes in the way, just know that that's the mind. It's okay. Bring yourself back to your center. Bring yourself back to my voice and simply allow the magic to take place. You may have physical sensations running through your body. You may feel a lot. You may feel nothing. Either way is absolutely perfect. Everyone is going to have a slightly different experience with this. Now, one of the tools that I utilize as a modality through this energetic architecture process where we rewire the geometries within your field is I work with my highest alignment of guides in order to bring through coded medicine, pieces of information, vibrations, frequencies, wave patterns, all these different layers of information through light and sound that come through my vessel and are then encoded within your field, allowing your upgrade process to be more potent and be even more easy and more graceful at the same time. So you may recognize it may sound like a language or a set of sounds. Again, either way, just allow yourself to receive and receive the magic, allowing whatever comes up for you to be absolutely perfect. So if you enjoy this activation, then feel free to go deeper into any of the other layers of my work. You can follow me on all of the social media platforms. It's all under Regan Hillier. And please, if you do desire to go deeper into any of my other courses or trainings, please make sure you reach out and let me know specifically that you came from this channel, okay? And you saw this video because I'll make sure that I look after you because if you're watching this, you're soul family. Okay, so let's dive deep into this activation. I love you so much. Thank you for watching. Hello and welcome to this activation, embodying your divine abundance template. Allow yourself to sit or lie in a comfortable position, allowing yourself to gently close your eyes, turning inward right now, being aware of your breath in and out and in and out and in and out beautiful as you allow yourself to gently be aware of your intention for this activation, your intention to activate and embody your divine abundance template so that you may be of greater service and hold more light, anchoring true abundance onto this planet right here, right now. Allowing this intention to now form within your field in alignment with your unique mission and purpose codes. Beautiful. Now from this place, allow a red laser beam to shoot down from your tailbone all the way down, all the way down into the crystalline core of the earth, anchoring you, solidifying you, grounding you into place. And simultaneously allow a golden laser beam of light to shoot up through your crown, connecting you all the way up to your unique soul star, allowing you to be guided, grounded, present, protected, and supported, heaven on earth embodied right here, right now, bubbling yourself with a ball of golden white light, beautiful, clearing and purging any energies that are not yours out of your system and out of your field now. Beautiful, blasting your own field with golden white light, purifying everything. That's right. Beautiful, and now take a moment to call in your guides, your divine guidance, uniquely and divinely assigned for you, beings of light of the highest vibration. You may be aware and invoke specific beings that you are working with deeply, or you may just simply request that your guidance of the highest vibration is present right now. Either way is absolutely perfect. That's right. Welcome, welcome, 
welcome. Beautiful. So from this place, we begin to open up through the fields and simply beginning to request that any pieces of information that is not in alignment with the highest frequency of abundance that is looking to be anchored through you, any of these pieces of information, allow them to simply start to gather within your system, within your field. You may see them gathering. You may feel them gathering. You may just know that they are gathering right now. Either way is absolutely perfect. Any old vibrations of fear, worry, doubt, that's it. Any lower light frequencies, any old vibrations that are not yours, any implants or imprints, any old mind programs, mental patterns, emotional patterns, allowing all of this to accumulate right now. Again, you may be aware of it or you may just simply be requesting that all of this accumulate. Beautiful. And from this place, Simply go ahead and request right now that all of these limits now leave your field instantly. That's it. Allowing them to drop, 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 dissolve, clear, dissolve, clear, and drop out of your system, out of your field now with ease, grace, and flow. Beautiful and allowing your system to begin to return back to its crystalline nature as you allow yourself to gently be aware of how much more space is created within your field, within your system right now. I decree and declare that that cleaning, clearing and purging process continues 24 hours a day, seven days a week until it's fully stabilized, clean, clear and complete. And may this process take place with total ease, total grace and total flow. Beautiful. Now from this place, you begin to remember that you can only receive in your life what you have the capacity to hold, what you have the space to hold. That's it. And so remembering as well that our frequency is our currency, I'm going to go ahead and simply update your vibrational signature and your vibrational frequency, allowing your vibrational frequency right now to gently begin to expand. That's it allowing this and requesting that all of this begins to simply update and run now faster 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 that's right you may see your unique signature now gently beginning to spin before your eyes beautiful spinning it faster 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 requesting right now that your unique signature and your unique vibration now spins and oscillates at the highest possible frequency of light which you are able to easily integrate and body right now <laughs> Beautiful, accelerating it even more. Beautiful, anchoring and stabilizing this now. No. 
yourself to now be permeated with your own light, feeling all of the layers of the information that is held within the frequency and the wave patterns of your own light coding. Nothing outside of you, everything within you. And on that note, go ahead and now simply request that any old outdated DNA that is no longer useful for your ascension process Request that this goes and simply drops, dissolves, cleans and clears out of the system, out of your field with ease, with grace and with flow. beautiful and requesting that any new dna that is looking to come online and wake up and be activated may it do so right now beginning to wake up wake up wake up wake up wake up wake up as you begin to remember who you are you remember who you are you remember why you are here you remember all of the innate gifts and coding and what we would call superpowers Allowing all of this to come online and wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up as you remember who you are, you remember why you're here. Nora mini sai kare me nai sai sh nora me nai si shia kare me nora mini se nori mini si shai wake up, wake up, wake up na rimini si shai Christ is shikari me nai si kare Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, nori mini sai krimini sai Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. I remember who I am. I remember who I am. I remember who I am. You may notice a glistening, crystalline like structure come, come, coming into your field right now. And as you draw your focus and your attention to this divine, beautiful structure, a structure maybe unlike any structure you have seen before. You begin to form awareness that this is indeed your divine abundance template. The template that is already coded with all of the pieces of information desired and required in order for you to truly embody the next layer of your abundance. This template is already preloaded and synced in order for you to truly live in alignment with the divine plan, to truly live in the highest frequency of service. That's it, inviting this beautiful divine crystalline abundance template closer and closer and closer within your field until it is hovering just above you and just before you. You may see it, you may feel it, you may just know that it is hovering just above you right now. Either way is absolutely perfect. And from this place, go ahead and allow this template to now gently enter your system. Beautiful. Entering through the top of your head right now, through your crown. That's it. Noticing the sensations as this divine accumulation of information and geometry begins to sink down right now through your physical body, activating and illuminating your brain center as it goes, dropping it down even further, activating your throat, your capacity to speak your truth when it comes to abundance in every form, allowing this to drop, drop, drop even deeper, even deeper and deeper until eventually this divine crystalline template is settling within the field of your heart, setting gently in the center of your heart. 
That's right. Beautiful. And from this place, with this divine abundance template nesting within the center of your heart, go ahead, tune into your heart and simply feel the pulsation. Feel the toroidal field. Feel the vibration. Feel the unique frequency associated with this template. That's it. This is what your new facet of abundance feels like. And if in any moments you lose this feeling, or you can't feel into what's next for you and your abundance and humanity, come back to the space that always lies within you encoded in the center of your heart's intelligence and simply close your eyes and request to feel this feeling that's it as you go ahead and allow this feeling right now to expand from your heart center expanding out through your heart and allowing this now to rush through your entire system your entire body allowing every single cell right now to light up with this divine frequency that's it. And when you are feeling this through your entire full body system, go ahead and double that feeling. That's it. Let it vibrate through every single cell of your being. And now go ahead and triple that feeling. That's it. Let it vibrate with every single cell. And just when you think it can't get any stronger, go ahead and make the feeling stronger. Letting it vibrate through every single cell of your being. is my natural state. Abundance is I am. Beautiful. And as all of this continues to activate within your system, we simply request that all of these updates continue 24 hours a day, seven days a week until they are fully stabilized, integrated, embodied, and complete. And may they continue to update through your system with total ease, total grace, and total flow. That's right. Take a moment to thank your divine guidance. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for always being there, guiding me, supporting me with every step, with every breath, if I am aware of it or not. Thank you. And taking a moment to thank yourself as you remember the divine alchemist that you are. Allowing yourself to just fill yourself with waves of gratitude. Knowing that your divine abundance template is activated and is nestled deep within you. Fusing with every moment into quite simply just who you are. That's right. I am abundance. I am abundance. <laughs>